to you from Mexico City. And today I want to do quick tips from Kimberly and it's going to be our third session. Today what I'd like to do is I like to go over the Project Advisor. It's a little feature that's included with Essentials and I don't think many people use it. I think it's very underused. So let's take a quick look at that. I'm going to bring up one of my designs from Hug Longer, Digital Designs. You bet your giraffe I'm cute. And what I'd like to do is I'd like to digitize this, or I'm sorry, I would like to stitch this on a onesie. And the onesie's a little bit thin, so I'm going to question as to what needle I need, what stabilizers I need, and things of that nature. So when there's questions like that, for me, the very best thing to do is use the resources you have with your Brilliance product. What I'll do is I'm going to go up to Utility, and I'm going to scroll down until I come to the Project Advisor. And when I click on there, this pop-up screen comes on. And right now it's set on Canvas. But like I said, I want to do this on a little knit shirt. Um, little baby ones, one piece outfit. And the fabric thickness is kind of thin, so I'm going to go with the light. Um, it doesn't stretch a lot, but it does have some light stretch to it. So now, if I come over to recommendations, I can see here, it recommends that I use a ballpoint size 12 to 14 needle, thread 40 weight, backing self-adhesive tearaway or water-soluble self-adhesive. And in the project notes, it's going to go right into good detail for you um, to let you know everything that will help you be the most successful in stitching your design. I think that stabilizing, using the correct thread size, the correct needle, are the things that are going to make people most successful in their embroidery. Um, also, it talks about hooping suggestions to tightly hoop the back and then baste the fabric and topping to it. So it, it will really give you some detailed information on exactly what you need to do to help your project be the most successful. And I hope this little tip has helped you. Thank you very much for listening and have a great day.